George Brandis is planning to retain all of our data. He will step in at the last moment and not let a journalist be put in jail for 10 years. Do you trust him? No, no neither do I. We've had 350,000 plus warrantless interceptions of Australian citizens in the last year. This information is being looked at by every Tom, Dick and Harry. Many different government departments are looking at your data and like intelligence agencies, they are trying to join the dots. Now there's one thing that's worse than the invasion of your privacy and that is when the dots are joined incorrectly. That is the biggest danger. And I think all of you, you need to be absolutely anonymous online. Read the intersect, and you have the other person who was talking to Edward Snowden, who explains very well how to really stay anonymous. Resist. You don't want to be characterized as terrorists. You don't want your dots to be joined incorrectly. And finally, one word, and I hope you'll all join me, to George Brandis. Get a warrant! Get a warrant! Get a warrant! control of those decisions. No one knows, no one questions it. It's sort of like how a donkey would ever question why the carrot dangling in front of it's not getting closer. Like the donkey will keep on walking forever going, yeah man, I'm going to get that carrot at some point. And then you try and tell that donkey, you're like, hey man, do you realize there's like a rod and like a string there? And like the donkey's like, mate, all right, I don't have fucking time for conspiracy theory shit, man. I got to put fucking carrots on the table for me. Kids, I got bills to pay. Stop. 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 Yeah. Love each other, guys.